Oh, I forgot to mention that I hated the hair. What hair? Her hair? This hair? No hair? Hey! Hi, people. Welcome if it's your first time. My name is Talia Adewale. And I'm Hamza Amoro. And this is Despite Them. Today we're going to be talking about the 2023 Apple TV movie Ghosted starring Chris Evans and Anna Diamas. Be sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you know when we post new videos. Let's get on into this. So Ghosted is an American, it's a 2023 American romantic action adventure comedy film. Jesus, why did he need to describe these things so long? That was a story. Hoi! Directed by Dexter Fletcher and written by Red Reese, Paul Warwick, Chris McKenna. We don't need all of this. <laughs> <laughs> It, um, it follows a guy who was ghosted, basically, as the name implies, and he goes on this romantic gesture to go and find the girl, and, well, it turns out that she's part of uh, CIA, or is it FBI? I think it's CIA. CIA, <clears throat> and, yeah, and then it just, it kind of develops into a ton of hijinks, and, yeah, it goes on from that. Yeah, it was a solid movie, streaming movie, and I'm happy that it came out on streaming and not the cinema. Um, great performances, awesome cameos from do we a have ton of people. Yeah, we can spoil it because it's been a while now. Um, there are amazing cameos from um, Anthony Markie. There are so many people. Um, Ryan Reynolds is in it. Like so many cameos. Um, Sebastian Stan. Sebastian Stan. Um, Marwan oh. Kenzari. Yeah. yeah, a lot of people. John Cho. John Cho was in it. T. S. R. Khan. Like there are a lot of people, honestly. So a lot of cameos that we didn't expect. It's really, really funny. Um, the action scenes were actually good. I think um, the main, um, the lady, Anna Diamas. Anna Diamas played an amazing role. I don't know if she did all her stunts herself. Or I don't it, think so. But it, but it was flawless. It was flawless. It yeah. was really, really good. I also like the fact that Chris Evans was like the hat rob. You know, it was a flip instead of. You know. That was my thing for this. Even when I did tra trailer reaction, I was like, it's usually the reverse. Usually yeah. it's the guy who's in the CIA or the FBI, yeah. and it's the girl who goes and finds out about it. And so the fact that they flipped it in this one, I was elated. I was very happy about that. And then we watched it. I honestly forgot about this because I was looking for it and it didn't come out. And then I remembered that it was Apple TV. Yeah. And then we watched it. And I've seen it like two times now, maybe three. Mm -hmm. I loved it. I loved it. It's a it's a very generic popcorn flick for sure. Like it's a kind of movie maybe date night. You guys go, you watch it, you have a good time. Mm -hmm. It's not it's not uh, solving world hunger no. or it's winning not Oscar. Serious. It's no, not that thing. serious, and I love it. Like it was done well. It was funny. Mm -hmm. The it was we're about to fight. <laughs> <laughs> It was funny, it was. and I think the action scenes were done well too. I mean, the acting was great. Everybody was like a seasoned actor in it, right? It was just okay. In, in some part, I felt they were they were just there for the paycheck. Yes, Adrian Brody. I I couldn't tell his accent oh until they God. said he was French. Was he French? I think so. Oh my God, that was Russian and or something. Cute, like, he was just confused. It was all over the place. Man needed some 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 accent yeah, trainers. That's why I felt he was for he was really because he's a very good actor. And, I and he thought he was phoning it in because it was just uh, yeah. casual. Yeah, and he, it was, I thought it was Russian. He was French. Yeah, but he had no business being in a comedy movie when he loves indie projects. It don't matter. It's still like, with his caliber of acting, he, he should do better. He should have, but that's on him, right? The onus yeah. is on him for yeah. accepting the project and then letting it fall down. Anyway, that accent was not just. It's yeah. not, sometimes be like the beginning will be mm. French, middle will be Russian, last part will be German. I'm like, what the yeah, hell? Yeah, like, his, his accent needed some work in that one. Other than him, which is weird yeah. that he was the main problem in this thing. Yeah. I thought it was great. I loved the family. The mom oh, wow. was hilarious. The sister, even more so. And, and the I dad. Just, I just loved his family, honestly, it was great. You have, you, there are a lot of plot holes, you have a lot of questions. The fact that Chris Evans all of a sudden could like, you know, hold his own no, against it, assassins. Well, they said he was, a, he was a wrestler in school. So most of his moves were wrestling, he was always like flipping there. That's true, he did do a lot of flips. Okay, yeah. so that makes, I, I missed that, I watched it twice, I missed that. He was a wrestler in college. Right, because the dad always kept saying, tell him about the, the wrestling. wrestling. yeah. Oh my so god, how did I block that out of my Jesus. memory? Jeez. Okay, 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 okay. But it was still... Kind of, you, even if you're a wrestler, these are seasoned 
guys. And yeah. Then, you can't take them on like that. And the way he was doing it, he, he, he looked like Captain America just doing wrestling. He did. He, he did. Was like, this is just Captain America just he flipping did. people he around. Did. So. There were a lot, I think there were a lot of funny moments. I love that all her exes were losing body parts. And yeah. I was like, what is up with this girl? <laughs> it kind of reminded me of that Tom Cruise and um, Cameron Diaz movie where he was a spy and he saved her. He wasn't supposed to. <gasps> Day and night. Day and night. Ooh, kind of I forgot about night. Day and but night. But Day and night is a way better movie than this one, though. Oh man, it's true. Day and night. But Day and night is the flip again. It's the what is what we're used to. This is this is. Opposite. I understand, but I just feel like this one was a little bit scooched down. To be honest. I also like that the attraction was not instant. Like they, they weren't attracted yeah, to each other at first. And even after like they hooked up and everything and he went basically stalked her to a different continent. Yep. Um the attraction was not there. Like yeah. it kind of built over the course of the movie. Yeah. I thought that was good. Honestly, I liked it. I'm definitely gonna be giving it a higher score than he is. So No, I liked it. I'm just saying it's a solid movie. Um that's about it. It's funny. A lot of plot holes, like you said, yes. but it's a, it's still a solid movie. It's a stream. I like it because it's stream. Yes. You know, like if you went to theater, I'll definitely be in the screen. No, I'll still be okay with it. Nah, because I feel like we've seen this again. Like everything that we've seen, there's nothing new under the sun. Hmm. We've seen this play out all be True. before, and and I think it's been done a little bit better. Yeah, bit better. critics are definitely like slamming the movie too, which is unfair, I think. It's only unfair because I like it, people, obviously. <laughs> they are, and that's fine, right? But on a scale, what would you give it? I'll give it, you know, solid date night movie. I'll say 7. You have yeah, a good I think time. so. I think 7.5 is fine. You have a good time. Um, will I watch it again? Probably. Yes. But I won't be as, um, like, I won't concentrate like I did the first time. Mm. I was just like, it'll be like, sort of like... It took you two days to watch it. Yeah, that's how I watch movies. It's that really annoying. I'm not really like catching my attention. I can watch other stuff. <laughs> yeah, but definitely, I recommend if you have Apple TV, like find it and stream it. Honestly, yeah. I don't think you'll be as disappointed. It's not like a letdown movie. Like no. you watch it and you're like, oh, that was crap. No, it's actually it holds its own for what it is. It's not Power Rangers. <laughs> let let it go, Sorry. man. Let it go. <laughs> But yeah, we hope that you guys enjoyed our review. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and hit that notification bell so you know when we post new videos. And we will see you in the next one. And also check out the merch. Hey, babe with the plug. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, bye. Bye. Au revoir. <laughs>